Assalamu alaikum and good morning to the first one and say yes to me. Let me introduce my group member, myself, Anwar Shafiqi Asiyan, Matrix member 05, UCU 28 and UCU 3, UCU We will present about U.S. management. Myself, I'm Shafi, and my friend, Yusufi. Production about U.S. U.S. is one of the fastest growing U.S. team on the planet. Already, we produce something like 15 million tons of it each year, and that numbers only set to increase as electronics become more accessible worldwide. U.S. or electronic goods encompass electrical and electronic equipment that outdated. from smartphone to end of life is requested. Basically, anything that runs on electricity that you have decided to get rid of globally, we only recycle of our US a number of it, as shocking as it is depressing. As for the 90% we would on the cycle is an up getting when filled incinerated or illegally traded. U.S. recycle will use process such as up and open incineration and acid chain. This situation could be improved by creating awareness and improving the infrastructure of recycling units along with the prevalent policy. Electronic products are divided as the electronic waste when they are discarded because they are obsolete and no longer is used. According to the definition of the European Parliament and consists of weak directive, which can be divided into the different categories. E-waste recycling is the recycling of metal from all equipment for use in the new product. After the E-waste is recycled, the materials in E-waste will be processed and separated into the new product that can be used or shown as usable raw material for the product of new electronic product or other products. Next is the categories of e-waste. We know then some electronic waste may be dangerous because it contains a toxic metal. Need to be handled properly, otherwise serious risks on pollution will be blown. Some electronic products are also variable. For example, the scrap in one motor block can recover more than 1,000 ringgit per ton. However, the number of electronic waste is increasing at an amazing speed every year. And the electronic product has been out of time and the scrap rate is high. Then from the number of global electronic waste is already increases. We have three ways to handle the e-waste. We can buy e-waste in the soil, but it's not environmentally friendly and toxic substance may be released in the soil and go further in this way. We can also handle electronic waste through incineration. We can effectively reduce the e-waste. However, it has the disadvantage to harmful the gas into the environment. We can also recycle electronic equipment such as mobile phone, laptop, keyboard, and data line. The system can be recycled.
This is what we currently encounter in US with increase the electronic waste due to outdated and technical change and we last church of US. US hazards out help because electronic waste contain a toxic system. This has brought the risk to work from US recover milk. US restoration also has led to large of e electronic products. After the service life of electronic products is over, the performance of electronic waste is limited to this cladding. Only a few people will consider the environmental impact on the treatment of e-waste. Problem solving related to sustainability and green engineering. What can we do? We can practice we are recycle, reduce, and reuse. Recycling, reduce, reuse, and reproducing electronic goods such as telephone, laptop, monitor, motherboard, television, and more as a new product. For example, the Tokyo 2020 Olympics produce medal from donation of unused. We should run awareness campaign. All parties, namely the government, NGO, and the public, must work together in solving the problem of fire of use ethical good by holding career awareness campaign, such as the US campaign. This is very much in line with making the earth free from pollution due to electronic waste. Then, awareness among consumers and manufacturers. This is Olympic Tokyo 2020 medal. The Tokyo Organizing Committee of the Olympic and Paralympic Games Tokyo 2020 conducted the Tokyo 2020 medal project to collect small electronic devices such as used mobile phones from all over Japan to produce the Olympic and Paralympic medal. Conclusion is that we agree need to evaluate the current and future scenarios. Existing e-waste disposal method require a systematic infrastructure, including e-waste recycle and disposal environment impact to handless environment measurements in the nature or regardless level. This will effectively implement the recycling plan and is also hope the customer can be recycle the use of scrap or updated electronic product to help reduce the increase in e-waste.